guys and welcome here so in today's video i'll tell you how you can teach your kids before and after concept when it comes to teaching them before and after numbers or alphabet and also how you can teach bigger number and a smaller number because that can get really confusing for parents as well like how to teach this concept but the first thing is both the uh, topics goes uh, hand on hand so you have to follow the step by step process otherwise you can also get confused like how to explain this topic and i totally understand that and i'll be showing you all the practical thing that you have to do with your kids so stick around uh, till the end of this video if you have found me through this video i'm pragya i make videos related to lifestyle homeschooling and parenting so if you enjoy these kind of content be sure to subscribe and now let's get started with all the steps <music> The very first step I would like to give is to start teaching this kind of concept when your child is almost 4 or 4 year old it will be much easier for them to understand because it can get little confusing for younger kids the very first thing you have to teach them is the concept of bigger object and a smaller object so it is very easy whatever you have in the practical life you can tell them like which one you can just ask them which one is the bigger object which one is the smaller object and then you have to move toward the next step which is all about more or less so when it comes to more or less you can do it with two kind of activity which is hands on activity with some kind of blocks or any manipulative or you can do also with the water pouring activity for this you can give them two glasses and a jar full of water and ask them to pour little amount of water in a glass and little more amount of water in another glass and then ask them which one which glass has less water which glass has more water or you can teach them through blocks and these kind of telegrams so uh, you know just any kind of manipulative will work in this no peeking no peeking okay no peeking <laughs> okay now tell me which which group has more blocks that is more mm -hmm. and that is less that's right okay so the right again do huh? your eyes okay now i will first and find and don't the big it okay no i will not peek only eyes okay that is more yeah and that is less okay mommy okay thank you so much nervi you can give them these kind of a uh, worksheet this is from my uh, math workbook once your child has mastered the concept of bigger and smaller more and less then comes the next step third step which is all about teaching them before and after concept now before and after concept it will be much easier for you to teach them through the chart today only in the morning i taught nirvi uh, the before concept i had already taught her the after concept it is very easy um they just pick it in 1 minute 2 minutes or even one day or two day of practice will be needed and it will be much easier now let me show you the glimpse how i taught her what is this number ha huh? 20 huh? 26 26 where is number 26 26 26 okay what will come before 26 Twenty-five. That's right. Twenty-five. Yeah. What will come before twenty-five? Woohoo! Yeah. 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 Okay. You have to circle twenty-five. Then number twenty. Twenty-nine. Where is number twenty-nine? Mm. I think it's here. Twenty. and once your child has mastered this before and after more and less concept you can give them these kind of uh, worksheet and this is again from my math workbook which nirvi did did it today and yeah so all the uh, you know you can make these kind of worksheet like which one is the biggest object smallest object they have to circle so these kind of worksheet are really helpful just in case if you want it link is in the description box if you get the whole bundle it is going to be on 40% off so be sure to check it out it can be a really win win situation in all the workbooks i have included writing practice and also logical worksheets 
so you, you don't have to go anywhere everything is bundled up for two to five year old kids and now the last concept is how to teach them bigger and a smaller number so for bigger and a smaller number again you can do it with the chart or with the scale so what you have to do is just take a scale and you have to teach them through the top and bottom number so for example just f uh, put a finger on one and four now how i will do okay which one uh, which number is on the bottom four so four is bigger one is smaller then you can just put like three and seven now which number is on the bottom seven three is on the top so it is smaller so big a bigger and a smaller this is how you can teach through the scale or through the chart it's so yeah, this is how you can teach before and after concept and bigger and a smaller concept. Be sure to also check out the homeschooling playlist where all the content is waiting for you to check out and it is going to be really helpful for you for sure. That's that's what I really believe in. If you enjoyed this video, if you got some inspiration and idea from this video, be sure to give this video a like and also share it with your friends and family because you never know who can get help from uh, this kind of videos. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.